So today, <laughs> today, all right. So today we have a um, air compressor for tires. Now this is by uh, Livawaney. Now, I was checking on the internet. I have a lot of tires that are always flat. <laughs> I, my grandkids come over, their balls are always flat. <laughs> so I need a little air compressor. Yes. So I was looking on Amazon. Livawaney had this little air compressor. Now this is a 20 volt air compressor cordless, so I can take it wherever. I don't need a, a cigarette lighter uh, input. I don't need to plug it in. <laughs> it works off a DeWalt battery. So batteries don't come with this kit. You supply your own, but the benefit is the cost. Uh, very budget friendly because you don't have to worry about buying batteries that you already have or a charger you already have. It's tool only. So that saves you a lot of money. <laughs> so I like to save money. That's, that's what I'm here for. Now, this is the kit. So you have the tire inflator itself. Let's open this up. So, Okay, it comes with the tire inflator. That's the compressor. It comes with, uh, these are for the tires. Now this is an add-on uh, that you connect to the valve and then you close it, that locks it on. So that's for tires. It comes with an instruction manual, <laughs> which is always good. If you're feeling lost, check the manual. All right. Now, it comes with these little attachments now these attachments are if you want to air up a ball basketball football comes with that comes with the other attachments in case you want to air up an air mattress or air up small stuff or it even has a little valve that you can attach to air up different stuff it gives you four or actually gives you five different ways to air something up so which is really cool now there's the attachments now let me check out the unit here so the the cable is long enough to go almost wherever you want it to uh, you can screw it directly to a valve of a tire or you can add this to it here and these just screw on really easy so really cool. Uh, it's got the braided hose to last a long time. It's got the brass fittings. Now, the unit itself. Uh, the pads it sits on, a nice rubbery pad so it won't slide. And while it's, it's running, it won't vibrate itself to death. Um, the handle has a nice grip to it. So it's got a nice rubber grip. I uh, like the design. They got the cool design going. Um, the plastic itself is the really thick, um, durable plastic that is really nice on these. That way they don't crack, they don't break. You can, you can drop them a little ways <laughs> without them busting. Um, and then the fittings, these fittings will snap into place here so whichever ones you use the most I think these go in here so you can just kind of clip them all in now these are good for on the go if you go on a field trip <laughs> go on vacation uh, it, it's good for emergencies in your car this one has a multi-function light in the front Let me get this little screen thing off so if you're out in the rain, out in the dark, uh, you can see what you're doing with the light. Let me get, okay. I wanna show this as I go. So this works with the wall batteries. This is a little uh, one amp hour battery. Clips in really nice, really lightweight. It has uh, the digital display up top. But <laughs> if everything's new and shiny, now, I'd rather take, I get the generic batteries, 
because the quality is the same and I get a better deal. Budget guy. <laughs> now, that's why when I came across this, I was like, hey, I got a battery for it. Clips in nice. Uh, now, this compressor goes up to 160 pounds. <laughs> I was like, wow. So 160 pounds of this compressor. That, that is awesome. Because, uh, say if you have a trailer or you have something that, that holds a lot of pounds of pressure, you got an inflator for it. And the best part about it is, um, you have a couple of batteries with you when you go on vacation, you got to air up a, a trailer tire or your car tire or your truck tire, um, bring a couple of batteries and it just goes and goes and goes. So with that being said, it's got a real easy to see. You got your flashlight here and that has different modes. That's, that's so if you're working on your car, um, it's got an SOS mode. It's got a flashing mode. That way you don't get ran over while you're working on your car on the side of the road. Um, but yeah, it's got a nice nifty flashlight so you can see what you're doing. You just grab it, stick the battery in, and then you're off. It's got five preset modes. Let's see. So you could do uh, your car, you could do your motorcycle, you could do a ball, you could do a bicycle tire. And it's got freehand mode, which I like because you set it in here. Let's see, like this tire here, for example. Now, I always have flat tires. I mean, somewhere, somehow, I have a flat tire. So what I would do is this one's set at 24 pounds. Now, <laughs> you can tell how flat this was. By the by the ring where it was sitting in the mud. <laughs> it was flat. So it's at 24 pounds. Pop that on. So I'm gonna preset this. Now when you click it through, it says car, it says motorcycle, bicycle, ball, or freehand. It has a little guy. And then you can go up right here, or you can go down. And I have to go down because it's got to be 24 pounds. So you go down to, oop, you go down to 24 pounds, and then you hit the. And it shows you the pounds that are going up at the same time and then when it gets to 24 pounds it stops <laughs> it doesn't over inflate you don't have to worry about standing on it uh, 24 pounds exactly and that's what that takes yeah everything's all nice and tight and shiny come on there we go so that aired that up. Now we have a football. So what we're gonna do, now like I said, everything that I get is flat. By the time the grandkids come over, they're like, we can't play with that. So let's try this out. So I'm gonna give you some examples. Now like I said, it, it's that quick. This This is a very good unit and we're gonna put the ball inflator on it now this is cool because the ball inflator now this is if you're not sure exactly they, they have these settings so you can do the settings car now wait a minute we'll, we'll go through the whole thing again so it says car at 36 pounds that's the average car tire pressure uh, motorcycle 32 pounds that's the average motorcycle so it takes kind of the guesswork if you don't know. Uh, bicycle, 30 pounds. Ball, 8 pounds. So let's check this out. <laughs> so you have a flat ball. Poke that in. And now we're going to hit go. There, 
eight pounds. Boom. Now the ball is nice and ready to go. Grandkids are going to have fun. Um, yeah, because we don't care about pleasing the kids. It's the grandkids you want to please now. <laughs> so, yeah, work. works great. I didn't have to worry about it overinflating it. Uh, it takes the guesswork out, like I said. Um, if, if it's your car, if it's your motorcycle, it's already preset. You just take it out, air it up, and then everything goes back. Um, I keep I keep things kind of together like this because I'm going to use it on tires the most. So I'm just going to leave this on here like that. Yeah, and then it just kind of wraps around, and then you're ready to go. Nice little unit. Like I said, there's the modes here. Let's see if I can, you know what? Let's get a little bit up close and personal. Let's kind of squeeze my way in. <laughs> see, there is the settings here. You can see the little button as it goes through the different modes. And it's not heavy. It's a good little unit. And you set it up the way you want to. It's got the light mode, so you got the different modes on the light. You got the SOS, you got the hey, don't don't run me over in the street, and then you have a regular light. So up, down, power button, and then the display. Very easy to use. That's right out of the box. Turn that off. And there you go. So this is the Lithuani. Um, a very good unit that that is a nice little unit it airs up things really fast takes seconds and then you still got the battery to use your drills and everything else uh, very inexpensive and there we go so the cordless tire inflator <laughs> by the Lithuania <laughs> all right that's what I got for today I'll see you guys next time thanks